Hello and welcome to History Pod. On the 14th of January 1943, the Casablanca Conference began in Morocco. The conference saw the combined chiefs of staff join American President Franklin D. Roosevelt and British Prime Minister Winston Churchill to discuss the future strategy for fighting the Second World War. Representing the Free French Forces, Generals Charles de Gaulle and Henri Giraud were also in attendance, although they took a minor role in the discussions. Roosevelt's attendance at the conference marked the first time a president had left American soil during wartime. Meanwhile, the Soviet leader Joseph Stalin did not attend, as he felt his presence was needed at home during the ongoing Battle of Stalingrad. The Casablanca Conference saw the national leaders agree to invade Sicily after the completion of the North African Campaign. This was intended to divert Axis forces away from mainland Europe and weaken the German defence ahead of a later Allied invasion of France. In return, Churchill agreed to send more troops to the Pacific to help in the fight against the Japanese. The leaders also agreed to launch combined bombing missions against Germany and to destroy German U-boats in the Atlantic. Details of the conference were kept from the public until the participants left Casablanca, although a number of journalists had been invited to a press conference on the 24th of January where vague details of the discussions were announced by Roosevelt. Coming as a surprise to Churchill, Roosevelt announced his demand for the unconditional surrender of the Axis powers. This had been discussed at the conference, but had not been fully embraced by the British Prime Minister. 